Hey YouTube, what's good? It's Sky. I am going to do this review in my car because I'm out and about and the sun's about to go down and I just wanna, I've had the can sitting here and I intended to do the review in the car. Yeah, it's getting a little late for that. But I got these two days ago, doesn't matter. But uh, I know there's a lot going on in this flavor. Uh, that I There's no way I could remember it all, especially since I'm on my phone and I would have to stop the recording if I was looking because the, ca the camera app on the f iPhone is weird like that. But I know lots of people have just been getting ma majorly just orange notes. So I don't know how I'm going to feel, uh, but w we thought this was like a blood orange, like reskin, but in a can but uh, it's not but blood orange is in it and then another type of orange as well so i don't know but here is the can it's a really cool can soon we'll be getting the other two halloween themed cans they just posted about that to today um so it's chucky and then nightmare on elm street are the other two let's just get this going crack into this bad boy The dude just be smelling like orange. I wiped it and then it went further up into my nose. Interesting. I could have done this review earlier, but uh, I didn't go to GNC. I have GNCs here, but I just didn't end up going. So I waited for them from G Fuel. So <laughs> we're finally gonna try it here today. So let's just go ahead and uh, give this a try and see uh, if I like it. Yeah, let's go. It's been sitting in my car for maybe like an hour at this point but it's still a little bit cold but it probably would be different if it was colder i, I should have thought about that but uh i ordered taco bell and i went to go get that and then i ran into the store for uh some hand sanitizer and batteries productive day <laughs> so this isn't that bad i think ehoff i think he is the one that i'm thinking of that said it tasted kind of like some sort of Sprite or something like that, but I don't know if I'm getting that. But this isn't bad. It's not something that I would honestly drink a lot of. Well, often. Or buy again, I guess. And this is also one of the newer cans with 140 milligrams of caffeine, so it's got that going for it. It's kind of meh. Keep it real. So, it's not bad. I'd probably give it a 6 out of 10. It's not something that um, I'd love. But uh, it'll definitely grow on me. Because seriously, most G Fuel cans grow on me. And uh, the reason why I say that, even if I can try a can and I'm like, I really don't like this. I'm going to burp. Hang on. It's because... Blood, sweat, and tears in a can kind of grew on me. And I know that that's freaking weird because that's the cinnamon one. But it did. I drank my whole 12-pack. Well, one of them I might have had to dump because it was busted. But I drank it all. Anyways, as you can see, the sun is setting right here. So let me know what you thought of Hack and Slash if you decided to pick it up. The Chucky one is good, guys. And I just saw the name of the Freddy Krueger one, and I think it was Blood Demon or something. I can't remember, something something demon. Maybe it is Blood Demon. But, decided to give those a shot. Those, what's in my mouth? Taco. Um, those, they could potentially be coming to the G Fuel website, kind of like how this one did, except when they do those live events, they always get screwed up. But I know that you can get this can on GNC's website and also in GNC's you should be able to find them but the other two might not be at GNC or they will be maybe one of them will be at vitamin shops or something so we'll see so make sure you keep an eye out on their uh their socials for that 
but yeah, that's going to be it for this review today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, let me know what you think of Hack and Slash and check out all my links down in the description. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and subscribe for more content from me. I'm sorry my steering wheel is right here. What is in my mouth? Black bean skin. But I have a MagSafe uh, car mount and it's, it's, I can't really move it away from the steering wheel. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.